which makes me, I believe in evil. What is evil? Define evil it is me. a word. Evil Why implies... That? What is it? What is it? Yeah. Okay. It's the act of doing something that is bad. What is or bad? Bad is something that goes against your conscience. Whose conscience? conscience mine or yours? is something that is mine. I keep it okay. mine. So I you're, will not give it you up. You make yourself the god of the universe. You are the standard of righteousness. That's why you are a humanist. And you believe that you draw the line in the sand, and anyone that violates your line, they are evil. No. I'm well, then what is evil? Says, you are calling this whole belief is calling everyone evil. Yeah, but what's your standard, and where do you get it from? My standard lies within myself. Right, humanism. So then, do you, what the, do you allow that I would call evil? Are you okay with sex outside of marriage? Yes. Are you okay with molest with uh, an adult having sex with a child? <laughs> I can't believe you would compare those two. <laughs> well, since you don't have the fact that you would take molestation of a child. There was no comparison. I was asking questions in a succession. There wasn't a comparison. <laughs> okay. Then no. Cannibalism. No. What? <laughs> you're basing this off me. You're just making my point more clear. I'm not the fact that I, believe, I want to know what your standards. I want to know is. if you don't, if you're okay with killing your neighbor, we have a problem because you become God and you be dictate morality. You're a humanist. Mm. That means that if I think something is wrong that you don't, you might do it to me. <laughs> okay. Well, so I have to know what you believe in and why you believe in it. What makes it good or evil? And you say, well, just because I don't like it or I do like it. So you're going to make that, a fierce, fierce generalization about everyone in the world what I am based saying is off there, of what you think. There are universal absolutes that are not contingent upon your personal likes and dislikes. God has dictated what reality is, what truth is, what evil is, what good is. And if we don't bow our knee to Him, we're going to end up in hell. You are not God. You do not set the standard of morality for humanity. And your convictions are so warped that you think you're doing right when in reality you're doing evil and it's going to cost you your soul. That is a lot of words. Yes. That is a lot of words being spoken from a man who is inherently evil. And redeemed by the Lord God Almighty and now I have a standard of righteousness that is not my own. If that gets you through the day, you yourself, then I suppose you are doing exactly what I'm doing, and that's keeping my soul in place through my mind. You have a soul? I don't need, I have a beautiful, wonderful soul. How do you know? It's light, and it's in the sun, How do you and it's all that is good. How do you know? Because, because, because I believe that, and I'm not going to hell. Just so your, your beliefs create reality?